This is the Run Safe Security Minute. We're here to provide one minute security briefs. Today's question is Eric, please demonstrate your subtraction method. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll start by kind of showing the traditional method. I was doing this on the whiteboard at work one day and my colleagues were, were like, what in the world are you doing? So I think the way, this is difficult for me to do because I'm just not used to it, but nine from eight uh, doesn't work. So you have to, let's get a pen here, change this to a six, make this an 18. You get nine from 18 is nine. Eight won't come out of six. So you have to cross this out, make this a zero make this a 16, eight from 16 is eight, and so on and so forth. I believe the correct answer would be 1589 if you continue down the line, but I'll demonstrate how I do it. So I do it a little differently. Uh, rather than crossing the top number out, I just add one here. So I'm basically adding 10 to the bottom and I'm adding 10 to the top. And so nine from 18 is nine. Nine from seven doesn't work, so I'll add one here and say nine from 17 is eight. And then six out of one doesn't work, so I'll just add one here. Six from 11 is five. And then one from two is one, and so you get 1589. So the reason I like this is this just looks messy to me. I guess the main reason I like it is because I've always done it this way. I don't ever remember learning this method. I've just had people show it to me since then, but I, I just feel like this looks a lot cleaner to me and it's just the way I've always done it. So that's how Eric does subtraction. Mm -hmm.